Now let us discuss about construction of regular grammar from the finite automata. So a finite automata is given. So from the finite automata, we have to construct regular grammar. So regular grammar means by default it is uh, right-linear grammar. So what is right-linear grammar? Uh, in the right hand side, uh, let the production is like this. S implies A, B. So this is right-linear grammar. Why? Because here in the right, right hand side, the rightmost symbol is non-terminal. If the rightmost symbol is non-terminal uh, in each production, then we can say that it is right-linear grammar. So regular grammar means by default it is right linear grammar. Okay. So let us construct the grammar. So totally two examples are given. So this is the first example. A is the initial state. So A on B will go to A. A on A will go to B. B on A will go to C. B on B will go to B. C on B will go to C. C is the final state. So let us see the first one. A. A on a on A will go to B. A on small A will go to B. Next, A on B will go to A. So, A on B will go to A. So, A transitions are over. Now, let us see B. B on A will go to C. B on A will go to C. Here, C is the final state. Okay. So, if we are reaching a final state, by applying an input symbol, then uh, uh, we can write it as like this. B implies A. That means even if there is no final state, then also if we apply the input symbol A on B, then we can reach us to the final state. Okay. So if we reach us to the final state, then in addition to AC, just we have to write uh, the terminal symbol also. That means by applying this uh, terminal symbol also, we can reach to the final state. Next, B on B. B on B will go to B. B on B will go to B. Next, let us focus on C. C. C on B will go to C. Here, what is C? C is the final state. So, if he, re if he reaches the final state by applying an input symbol, then without uh, having the state also, we can apply. So, we can write this as C implies B. C implies B. So that means if there is no state here, then also by applying B on C, we can reach us to the final state. Okay. So this is the regular grammar for this finite automata. If we observe this regular grammar, this is right linear grammar. Right linear grammar. Okay. There is no need to focus on these two productions. Why? Because these two are what? Terminal symbols. Here, these two productions contains only terminal symbol. If there is a non terminal at the right hand side, then it should be the rightmost symbol. Now let us see the second example. So totally four states are there. Q0, Q1, Q2, Q3. So Q0 on 1, Q0. Q0 on 0, Q1. Next Q1 on 0, Q2. Q1 on 1, Q0. Next Q2 on 0, Q3. Q2 on 1, Q0. Q3 on 0, 1, Q3 only. Okay. So now we have to write regular grammar for, from this finite automata. So regular grammar means by default it is right in a grammar. So Q0 on 0 will go to Q1. Next Q0 on 1 will go to Q0. Next state is Q1. Q1 on 0 will go to Q2. Next Q1 on 1 will go to Q0. So Q1 is over. Next Q2. Q2 on 0 will go to Q3. Here what is Q3? Q3 is the final state. So here we are reaching to the final state. Okay. So if there is a final state, then what will happen? We can write it as like this also. Q2 in by 0. That means even, <coughs> even if there is no state, then also if we apply 0 on Q2, then also we can reach us to the final state. Okay, so Q2 on 0 is over. Next Q2 on 1, Q0, Q2 on 1, Q0. Next, let, let us write on Q3. <coughs> Q3 on 0 will go to Q3. What is Q3? Q3 is the final state. 
So we can write one more uh, transition like this. We can write one more production like this. Next to Q3 implies 1Q3. Q3 is the final state. So we can write one more state like one more production like this. Q3 implies 1. So like this, we can construct a regular grammar from the finite automata. So here, uh, what is the additional point we have to focus is here if we consider this uh, problem, here C is the final state. Okay. So C and B will go to C only. Okay. Next, we, we have to write one more production as yes. C implies B. That means even in the problem, if there is uh, no C, then also we can reach us to the final state by applying P. 